Thank you, Alec. Also developing now, federal, state, and local law enforcement agencies are working together to make sure that criminals are off the street. Authorities just wrapped up a 100-day operation focused on a criminal street gang in Fresno County. Action News anchor Brittany Jacob joins us now with the results of the major arrest, Brittany. Graciela, in a joint press conference, law enforcement announced the arrest of 34 dangerous people in Fresno County. We're talking 55 search warrants coordinated by 700 law enforcement just yesterday. Authorities say the arrest of these men and women are expected to have an immediate effect in lowering violent crime in the county. Dozens of Central Valley gang members are off the streets after a multi-agency investigation in Fresno County, dubbed Operation Broken Buns, focusing on violent crimes, drug sales, and illegal firearms possession. Thirteen defendants are charged in the federal criminal complaint. This operation responded to multiple homicides in Parlier, Reedley, and Kingsburg. In Parlier, gang members killed two people in two separate incidents. The first was 16-year-old Ricardo Chavana Jr., a high school student with no gang ties. He was sitting on his bed when he was shot through the back window of his home. They killed my son, but they also killed me. The other victim was a farm worker, 52-year-old Savano Mendoza, who was on his way to work in June of 2021 when he was shot and killed by the same gang. The victim's daughter says she moved out of Parlier to feel safer. There's nothing in this world that's going to bring back my dad. You know, nothing, nothing at all. But I feel like he's not, he's not getting 100% justice that he should. During the operation, 26-year-old Francisco Munoz was arrested for killing Mendoza. It just goes to show the violence that these individuals committed upon residents and people in the community of Parlier people in the surrounding cities of Reedley, Kingsburg, in uh, communities in Fresno County and also in Tulare County. Operation Broken Bonds started in February of this year with undercover narcotics and gun buys, search warrants, surveillance, arrests, and uniform enforcement. But most of the search and arrest warrants were served Thursday with 34 people arrested, 13 of them facing federal charges for racketeering, drug trafficking, violent crimes, and firearm offenses. Cocaine, marijuana, methamphetamine, and fentanyl were seized along with 64 guns. Our communities are safer and people in those communities don't have to keep looking over their shoulders and don't have to put up with this level of violence that they've had to put up with for the last few months. Now tonight, all 34 defendants remain in custody. According to the Fresno County District Attorney's Office, they are working with prosecutors to finalize these investigations and a list of charges will be filed against the suspects by Tuesday. In the studio, Brittany Jacob, ABC 30 Action News.